I'm tracking a very cold end to 2014. Today and tomorrow both look frighteningly frigid, but we will track in warmer weather on New Year's Day. This morning, I do have a little bit of light snow to report. We're tracking some flurries or snow showers down south, mainly south of I-35. This is Max Track Radar. Got a little bit of blue near Opie, Emporia, Hartford, arcing back toward New Strawn and Coffee County. Some light snow for you guys. That will be coming to an end. The rest of us mostly cloudy today. Hopefully some sunshine late this afternoon, but what you're really going to notice is the very, very cold air now in place. Here's a live shot from our tower cam. It is an unlucky 13 degrees in Topeka. North winds coming in around 15 miles per hour. That makes it feel a whole lot colder. 11 is the current temperature for Manhattan and Wamego. 10 in Holton, 14 in Lawrence, 13 for Emporia, Eskridge, and Burlington. When you factor in that wind, ooh, feels like three degrees below zero for Topeka. Rossville and Silver Lake. Feels like negative four in Emporia, five below in Manhattan. And right now, Concordia, you feel like 13 degrees below zero. You guys are under a wind chill advisory. Could feel as cold as negative 20 this morning for Cloud County and Washington County. That wind chill advisory goes until 10 a.m. So bundle up, stay warm today. We do have Arctic high pressure tracking across the northern plains, keeping a lot of us chilly to close out the year. 13 in Topeka, much colder the further north you go. The wind chills up in the Dakotas at negative 30. Wow. Here's our next storm system, though, on the west coast. This is going to bring Las Vegas, Nevada, the chance at snow New Year's Eve night. They can see an inch of snow on the strip. This system will track into Kansas for Friday night and Saturday, giving us a chance at some snow to kick off this first weekend of the new year. On future track, we got cloudy skies this morning, clearing out in the afternoon. Maybe a little bit of sunshine today, but your high only 18 degrees. With clear skies tonight and light winds, it's going to be a really cold kickoff to the day tomorrow. Mostly sunny Wednesday, highs of the 20s. And we will leave it dry Wednesday night to ring in 2015. Here's your forecast for Little Apple New Year's Eve. If you're going to Aggieville. 15 degrees at midnight. That wind chill close to zero. At least it will be dry. Stay warm, have fun, and happy new year. Your forecast for today, 18 degrees. Morning flurries coming to an end. Cold and breezy. With that wind today, it will feel like we're near zero all afternoon. Polar bear perfect tonight. Just one degree when you wake up on New Year's Eve. The wind chill could be as cold as negative 10. Storm Track Chief Meteorologist Matt Miller, he's in tonight with more on that. Here's the seven day forecast. We are tracking in above freezing temperatures Thursday, January 1st, mostly sunny, a high of 35. Friday, 40 degrees. And then we're tracking that 30% chance of some light rain or snow on Saturday. We'll be monitoring that storm system for you. Natalie.